What is going on YouTube? This is Brooksy and welcome to the third edition of Road to Pro League and this episode will be solo. I am not playing with any of my mates so I'm not cheating, don't worry. But uh, we are playing Hardpoint on Slums and there's a nice two piece with a Bounce and Betty there. But yeah, we are playing Hardpoint on Slums and the setup I am using is, you all know what gun I'm using by now, surely. But uh, I can't remember what attachments I'm using. I hate the way it says customize, I'd rather it say what it is but... Uh, I am running the UAV, counter UAV and Guardian score streak setup and in this game I actually went big at the start within the first 30 seconds I think I got a Guardian and that really gave us a boost towards the uh, first hard point which is in the middle on this map so you know that gave us uh, most, of the, most of the hard point time for the first base which is you know the, one of the main hard point uh, one of the main hard point locations on this map and there's a nice little wall bang there assist but um, <clears throat> yeah, if you're serious about playing hard points, and especially if you're on league play, you're gonna want to use a guardian because it is a massive boost to uh, to help your team. Really, you know, it it's just like having a um, just a, a juggernaut basically in a corner, and it which doesn't move and constantly fires stuff. But yeah, uh, definitely use that. So. Uh, what I want to talk about today is the overpoweredness of shotguns and what you think will be in the recent uh, the latest update as you as you know the um, the major first updates are going to be coming out soon within the next few days so what you know what's your opinion what's your views what you think they should change what you think's overpowered and stuff like that and personally i think they should uh, they should numb down the, the shotguns the shotgun range you know, the damage is not too bad it's just the range at which they can shoot you at but and also, I've never thought I'd say this about a Call of Duty game, but I am fucking pissed off at sniping. Honest to God. I, I pick up the sniper, and I honestly think that some other people are just... They're either amazing at sniping, or it just needs to be nerfed. Because I, I find myself watching some kill cams and thinking, how the fuck did he do that? You know, there's quick scoping, and then there's just fucking aimbot. <laughs> there's there's got to be something, there's got to be a catch here because the sniping is actually ridiculous on this game. But, you know, I, I'm, I'm unsure whether they should nerf it or not or people are actually just, you know, they're actually just that good at sniping. So, you know, leave your views on that, leave what, how you think on that, that's just my position on it. I, I don't know whether they, whether I want them to nerf it or not, but it, it's definitely overpowered at the minute, so... Whether they'll make some changes on that, I don't know. We'll have to find out in the update. But uh, another thing is... This was supposedly in Black Ops 1 as well. And it is the connection type on which you play on. And as you know, I've been complaining a lot about the connection which I've been getting. You know, free bar against uh, American Host. And I always seem to be getting them throughout the day and not just at night now. But a little tip here, if you didn't know... When you go and find match on the lobbies, there should be an option to press X, and then you can choose which connection type you want to connect to, and it'll 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 uh, stay as that default for um, as long as you don't change it. So you could dashboard, go back onto the game, and it'll still be on that setting. But the setting is any uh, good, I think it is, and best. And when you when you set it to best, you will always get a four bar connection. And since I've changed it the best, I've always had a 4 bar and I've had no complaints about connection. You know, I've got no excuses now for dying or 1v1 gunfights, so you won't hear me complain about that much. So yeah, that, there's a little tip for you there. And also I've been using the black hat as well, which is, you know, I've found that to be quite amazing since I've been using that. But uh, I'll get more into that in um, the next commentary as we run out of time here. This is the end of the game. So I know it wasn't much gameplay and it wasn't very exciting, but the start of the game was actually the more exciting part. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed this episode and be sure to tune in next time. And as always, this has been Bruxy. Thanks for watching. Leave a like, leave a comment, leave your views on everything I've, uh, everything I've said in the commentary. Thanks for listening. This has been Bruxy. See you next time. Peace. What's going on, guys? This is Bruxy again, and just a quick update. I actually forgot to mention the rank, which I got up to in this uh, commentary. And also when the next episode will be out. So I got up to rank 22, I believe, in the Gold League. And don't worry, I'm much past that now. And I have got the, uh, the gameplay saved up. So the next few weeks, these episodes will be constant. And they will be 
at least two or three each week. But I think I will upload them on the weekends and maybe one on a Wednesday. But yeah, uh, thanks again for watching and uh, yeah, see you next time.